Europa, one of Jupiter's moons has a super tough icy shell, under this shell there is a really huge ocean, which is twice as big as Earth's oceans. Scientists think this ocean could have alien life, but it's a shame for us that we couldn't explore it before, due to design limits. Europa is very far from the Sun, but NASA scientists say they have found a way to explore Europa. First, Europa is about 630 million kilometers away from Earth, but that would not stop us from exploring it. Europa has also a thick layer of ice, up to 25 kilometers thick, making it hard for our missions, but NASA's engineers at the Jet Propulsion Laboratory have a plan, they will send a bunch of tiny swimming robots from a big mothership robot. One of the main robots for the mission is called Sesame, which can drill through Europa's ice by melting, cutting, and burning, and can reaching the ocean underneath. But what's next, after reaching the ocean? The Sesame cannot dive because it would be drained with all the ice drilling, but for swimming, the mothership using tiny independent micro-swimmers, like mini underwater robots the size of a cell phone. These micro-swimmers will detach from Sesame, the mothership, and move on their own to explore the huge ocean, but they were connected by a tether, and using a tether is tricky, because a space tether is a thin long cable that keeps spacecraft together, while they orbit a central body. Usually tether could get tangled, and untangling it in space is tough. NASA scientists suggest, the best option is to using an ultrasonic communication system, to send data between the microbots and the mothership. Europa is one of the only moon, that offers thrilling environments in our solar system, in our solar system, scientists have found ecosystems on Earth that live independently from the Sun, that using the energy from thermal vents, on the other hand, Saturn's moon Enceladus might also have thermal vents, and the microswimmers will also investigate them, this increases the chance of finding life in these ocean worlds. The design for this concept will take time, but it's worth the wait, because this design could be the way to hunt for life, in the distant water worlds. With various concepts being worked on, the chance of finding extraterrestrial life is exciting, but the question remains, how quickly can we make it happen, so what's you think, share your thoughts in the comments below, and don't forget to subscribe to Science Fellow, because together we will explore further.